Tomorrow we start our case, and I don't see what we're going to do. I hear myself thinking like all the other prisoners, trying to convince myself that everything will be all right, that the jury can't find me guilty because of this reason or that reason. We lie to ourselves here. Maybe we're all here because we lie to ourselves. Let's go. Someone's here to see you. Miss O'Brien came to see me this afternoon. She looked tired. She talked to me for almost an hour. Several times she patted me on the hand. Bobo's testimony hurt us, Steve. We have to find a way to separate you from King. But King's lawyer wanted to make sure the jury connected us. Because you look like a pretty decent guy. So, do you think we'll lose the case? No, I don't. Miss Moore, how often does Mr. King come to your house? About twice a month. He's my cousin. Do you remember the purpose of the visit? He was just dropping by. He saw a lamp that he thought I might like and he brought it by. We talked about Christmas coming up, but the lamp broke. They don't make things to last anymore. I think it was made in Korea or someplace like that. I don't have it now, but I did have it. Mr. Nipping, do you know, as a matter of fact, if Mr. King is right-handed or left-handed? He's left-handed. I know that because when he was a kid, I went out and bought him a glove, a baseball glove, and I had to take it back because he was left-handed. There are a lot of things you can do with film, but you don't have an unlimited access to your audience. In other words, keep it simple. You tell the story. You don't look for the camera technician to tell the story for you. When you see a filmmaker getting too fancy, you can bet he's worried either about his story or about his ability to tell it. You're going to have to take the stand, look at the jury and let the jury look at you, and say that you're innocent. I know the judge will tell the jury not to infer anything if you don't take the stand, but I believe that the jury wants to hear from you. The prosecutor's strongest point against you is the connection between you and King. She has Boba admitting to being in on the robbery and his link to King. You need to present yourself as someone the jurors can believe in. The prosecutor said I was lying. I wanted to ask her what she expected me to do when telling the truth was going to get me ten years. When they got you in the system, it ain't time to get all holy. You in the system, you needs to get out of the system. Well, truth is truth. It's what you know to be right. Mr. Harmon, did you act as a lookout for the drugstore robbery or check out the store so that a robbery could be safely committed? No, I did not. One last question. Were you in any way involved with the crime that we are discussing here? To make it clear, were you in any way involved with the holdup and murder that occurred on the 22nd of December? No, I did not. Did you hear Mr. Evans' testimony that... Let me put it this way. You heard Mr. Evans' testimony that you came out of the drugstore just before the robbery. Is that right? I heard his testimony. And are you saying it was just a coincidence that you were coming out of the store at that time? I don't know when exactly the robbery happened, but I know I wasn't in the drugstore that day.